We are looking at the EPH18 236SS. It's the squared off lip. It is a chimney style hood in stainless steel, dual level LED lighting. It's got their patented easy clean system. This removable shield comes off and this centrifuge system drains liquid grease from this tiny hole into this removable tray. Cleanup takes less than a minute. Now we get to see all the different ways the factory can make this hood. We're seeing it in a 36 inch wide, a 42 inch wide, and a 48 inch wide. All three of these models come down into this chimney 12 inch wide by 12 inch teep stack. This is a two blower model with 600 CFM. They use multiple blowers to achieve the 600 CFM at 6.5 zones. Using two blowers at a constant RPM of 1550 keeps the zone level down versus a single blower moving faster and faster to get up to that 600 CFM. So this is the preferable quiet magic lung system from the manufacturer. As we take a look at our venting options, you'll notice they make a wall louver high flow VP528. You can also look into their roof caps, either the VP541 or VP541 HP, depending on how steep your roof is. We have a video at venahoodparts.com to help you determine how steep your roof is and lock in which roof cap is gonna work best for your project. Now, when it comes to the straight pipe and the adjustable elbows, you can find these parts at any Home Depot or hardware store. On the wall louver and the roof cap, they are very desirable since they are matched to the circumference of the pipe and offer zero loss and zero restriction for the exhausting air. Some of these roof caps you find at Home Depot can be very restrictive. I do have an education course on YouTube, Ducting Do's and Don'ts, part one and two. I've reached about 1.3 million people in 10 years, and I've taken about 400 questions there on how to duck the home and give you the quietest possible scenario. I wanna draw your attention to the mounting height of this hood. It is 30 inches of space between the burner and the bottom edge of the hood. If you go with one of their three production duct covers, it's going to give you that 30 inches of space. That's the WDC R&D 1212 for an eight foot ceiling, WDC R&D 1224 for a nine foot ceiling, WDC R&D 1236 for a 10 foot ceiling. They do offer a removable front panel on these duct covers these days. It's very helpful during installation. If you have a really tall duct cover, you can remove that panel and tape down joints and joint connections after this hood has been installed on the wall, reinserting that front panel, giving you a really clean look. We know the hood's gonna work its best at 30 inches of height. The smoke as it rises off the cooktop begins to cool off at a certain elevation and has more lateral movement. However, I do have some customers that choose to hang the hood higher than the recommended mounting height. Here's a picture of a client we had a year ago that wanted to hang the hood at 32 inches of elevation. And of course they had a vaulted ceiling. This is gonna be a six to eight week lead time for us to order a custom. Please reach out to us at kitchenfoundry.com for cost. We spec a lot of these hoods for customers with a pro range that extends 28 inches into the room. That's going to give you great coverage over the front burner because this hood is 24 inches deep. We do have customers that don't want a hood quite that deep. They don't want it to protrude quite that far or maybe they have a drop-in cooktop. For these purposes, Venna Hood has three different chimney style hoods that have a 21 inch depth. As you can see, they are the SLDH and the PDH here. While we're on the topic of installation, this is a typical stud configuration in a kitchen. These studs are vertical. They can't be modified since they are structural. They might interfere with your plans to back vent. So you may need to excavate some drywall to make sure you have the clearance to run either the VP561 or a sweeping elbow just to make sure that that two by four isn't directly in line with our 12 inch stack. You might notice the icon on the top right hand corner of the screen. You can click this anytime during the video to take you back to Kitchen Foundry to see the models we have available. Our installation stop will be ventehoodparts.com where we have the back vent elbow, the roof caps, the wall louver, any purchase of a hood through kitchenfoundry.com and we will offer you free shipping on a roof cap or a wall louver. Please visit us. I'm eager to hear your questions on installation. Feel free to ask away here in this YouTube tutorial or on any of my installation videos.